control files, logging, archiving and recoverability. Let's start with logging. Logging records every transaction in redo log files. What this means is that every change made to the database is stored in a log file. It's called a redo log file because you can redo those changes. If you were to lose a part of your Oracle database and you had to recover from a backup that was, say, two weeks old, you could use the redo log files in combination with the archives to reconstruct the changes to whatever you lost. Once again, archiving stores old redo logs. What happens is that you have a limited number of redo logs written to from the redo log buffer. When those redo logs are recycled, just before recycling a particular redo log or at specified points in time called checkpoints, redo log files are written out to archive log files. A combination of the archive logs and the redo log files gives you complete recoverability of your Oracle database up to a point of failure. Thus, recoverability in Oracle is provided with a combination of logs or redo logs and the archive log files. The control file or control files since you can have multiples contain pointers which are used to coordinate between different files for instance if I lost a data file and I recovered an old data file as we already said two weeks back the control file would look at the data file and the archive logs and get from the data file what's called a system change number and it would execute changes from logs and archives up to the system change number that exists in the control file. This is how the control file would be used to coordinate the recovering of a lost file using an older copy of the lost file plus the logs and the archives. Obviously, if you do not archive your database, which means that you do not have to store the archive files as copies of the redo logs, your database is essentially not recoverable. The control file is very important because it maintains all the pointers between all the log files and all the data files. It coordinates between all the different files in the database. It is probably the singularly most important file in the Oracle database.